Hey, hey, Mario Rodriguez here, and I got the news that I'm sure most of you guys have heard by now, but Dragon Ball Super is either flat out over or on hiatus. I really hope on hiatus. I want more of this stuff, you know. But, um, yeah, uh, end of this March, after the Tournament of Power ends, the Space Survival Arc, Universe Survival, yeah, that's what it's called, the Universe Survival Arc ends, that's it. Not just a tournament, but like Super in itself will be over, or hopefully, on hiatus. So there's a brand new anime show coming out, it's going to like take place of that time slot. And I think that like always happens, like I don't know why, like I think in Japan, like they keep doing these new shows and new things. Like I'm not 100% sure, but I think back then, when Dragon Ball Kai, because it was just called Dragon Ball Kai in Japan, when Dragon Ball Kai ended the Cell Games, some new show came up and took its place. So, like it took like the longest time if you're even having doubts, like, will they ever make Dragon Ball Z Kai version, or whatever it's called, Kai version of the Boo Saga, and of course they eventually did. So that's what's going to happen now. Some brand new show, some brand new anime, that who knows, maybe the next big thing or whatever, is going to take place of Dragon Ball Super and that time slot, so it's, like, already over. And, um, and I don't know how they decide those things. Like, it's like they already know. Like, the, like the next day, there's going to be some brand new show in its place, so it's kind of weird. But, um, anyways... The people that make Dragon Ball Super, first of all, there's a brand new Dragon Ball Z movie, Dragon Ball Z Super Kai, whatever you want to call it, movie, coming out end of this year, and it's going to be about the Saiyans. I don't think, I don't think it's necessarily going to be Goku, Vegeta, and them, but I mean like the actual, I guess, the Saiyans of back then, I don't know, but it's about the Saiyans, they're kind of vague about it, I don't know the details, but they're going to make that movie this year. So, the guys behind Super, of course... You know, thanks us for watching, thanks for all the support, you know, supporting Dragon Ball Super. But also said, don't forget, we still got that movie coming out end of this year. It's going to be awesome. And we got new stuff. Stay tuned for new stuff. More stuff coming your way. So they still kind of make it positive that this might actually be a hiatus and not necessarily like, like the end, you know. And um, another thing is that he also asked about, like, will you make a new show? You know, like, like the next Dragon Ball, whatever you want to call it after this. And they actually said, why? It's not like if this one's ending. So... It gives hope, you know? Now, um, I don't know, like, for me personally, for Dragon Ball Super, I want Super to completely take over GT, like, the timeline. I really want them, like, for example, if they went through all the trouble of remaking the Battle of Gods, the Restoration F movie, into episodes, I don't see why you can't just, like, either skip or, like, really condense or something, the whole, um, Goku meeting Uba the tournament, just kind of condense that to an episode or two and just keep going after that because you know now we got like so many universes so many bad guys like for example the pride troopers are supposed to be i guess i don't know like the power rangers or whatever of whatever universe i forgot universe dark universe one I, I forgot the universe but the thing is that um they have to fight against someone right they, they gotta have like bad guys or something right they gotta have their own threats in their own universe while goku's of course fighting against cell or frieza boo whatever so like, why don't they do it that Goku goes to train with Oob, and while that's going on, like a year later or something, some bad guy, some big bad guy that actually kicked Jiren's ass, comes to Earth for whatever reason, Dragon Balls as usual, and now Goku and Oob, and then everyone else, you know, has to fight this new guy. Like, that would have been awesome. That would have, you know, been kind of cool. And, of course, a lot of people are having these, um, like, how should I say, theories or thoughts that the, the Grand Priest that's working for Zeno is actually like evil or, or corrupt or he's, you know, manipulating Zeno behind the scenes or whatever. And that would open up like a whole new arc. Like maybe the tournament's over, but now the angels and the Grand Priest are going to be like the next big enemies of the next big ultimate end all arc. But of course, we're, we're not going to see none of that. It's just going to end the tournament. So we don't know. Like we really don't know until the last episode. We don't know if the episode's going to really end. Because that's the thing though. It also depends how is it going to end. Is it going to end in the way that you can kind of tell that more shit's coming and like prepare yourself, it's coming? Or is it going to end like all nice and wrapped up in a pretty little bow that's kind of like, yes, Dragon Ball Super is officially over, that kind of thing. So like I really can't say, we don't know until we see that last episode, if the last episode actually feels like just the end of the tournament, or it actually feels like the end to the whole thing. So, we gotta see. But I do wanna say this, I do wanna say this, I've said it before, I think, I'm not sure, maybe social media or just amongst my friends, but I wanna say, the biggest thing, the most trollish thing they could possibly do for Dragon Ball Super, like the big, or Dragon Ball in general, the biggest fuck you to the fans, is if, 
the end of Super, like, let's say Goku defeats Jiren, universes are safe, everything's happy, and all that stuff, and then, like, like everything turns hazy, and then, like, Pan from GT is sleeping, and they're, wake up, Pan, wake up, you're having a dream, wake up, Pan, and Pan's like, oh, I just had the weirdest dream, and then as the camera zooms out, you see that Kid Goku, Trunks, Pan, Jiru, and the spaceship, and you see the spaceship flying, and they start playing the Dan Dan music, GT music, and like, like the series ends right there, like that would have been the biggest troll, the biggest everything, saying that Super was all the dream of Pan, that would have been the biggest, most trollish fuck you to the fans, and like the internet would literally like explode with like how, how pissed off they are of that, of course, we're not going to have that. Of course, I really hope they don't do that. Because, oh my god, if they do that, there's going to be hell to pay, I'm sure. Like, all these characters like Jiren and Hit and Beerus and all them just being the dream, you know? But anyways, um, back to seriously speaking here. Back to what little facts we know without speculations, without theories, without my own personal what-ifs. Basically speaking, the series will be either ending or on hiatus. End of this March, as the Tournament of Power actually ends... And, like I said, it really is up in the air because the thing is, these guys can say all they want about, wait and see, there's more new stuff, there's more new stuff, but if the series, if this last episode really ends in a way that it really feels like, like super, like, like final, like, like definitively final, then I don't know what they're going to do after this. We'll see what happens. And the thing is, for me personally, I want them to go forward because Dragon Ball Super, in, in the end of everything, with all the new stuff we found out, more universes, more transformations, God, Key, and all that, um, Dragon Ball Super still takes place after they defeated Magic Buu and before Goku met U at the end of Dragon Ball Z. So Dragon Ball Z is still the ending of everything we're seeing here, and I don't want that. I want them to actually go forward, go beyond. And you know, that's another idea. Dragon Ball Super could be this in-between segue, but maybe, I don't know, Dragon Ball Ultra, Dragon Ball God Key, Dragon Ball Kami, whatever. But the next new thing could finally be something that actually goes beyond Dragon Ball Z, beyond Goku and Oob, beyond the last episode of Dragon Ball Z with all this new stuff that we know about gods and more universes and all this shit. So, who knows? Who already knows? But anyways... I'll be watching, and I'll probably do one of those reaction videos, because last episode, I might as well do it for the last episode, but um, we'll see what happens. Mario Drink is here, and we'll see you next time. Hopefully, it's not the true end of Dragon Ball Super.